Harry, commiserations. It's a as a defender, it's quite a hard scoreline to take, I suppose. Yeah, definitely. I think if um, anyone's watched the game, I don't think four 0 reflects the performance of the team. Obviously, the sending offs changed the game. We started the we started the game slow. We wasn't keeping the ball. We wasn't our passing selves, and um, we got punished. And they went one 0 ahead. And to be honest, the first half was a bit of a grind for us all, and um, we didn't perform to our best. But I don't think they created much chances. So we knew we was right in the game at half time. The gaffer got into us at half time, and um, we come out in the second half and we was, we was the better team. Um, we was putting them under all sorts of pressure. We had all the ball. We were creating chances, and to do that, good and some parties. Credit to the team, but like I've said, obviously, I think a very soft decision for, to send Tom off um, has changed the game. But sloppy by ourselves, to be honest, because when they scored a second goal and you're down to ten men, we should know we're. Uh, just kill the game off, take the 2 0 move on, but 4 0 flatters them, and uh, we have to get our heads up in uh, two good home games coming up where we can try and get maximum points. Yeah, going back to what you've just said there about the red card, and you feel it may have been a little bit harsh. What was your initial viewing? Because obviously you went in for the slide tackle first. Yeah, I think there was three or four slide tackles. It was like a little bit of a scramble, and I can't see what Tom's done any different to any of my tackles or any of the other players' tackles on, on myself. So. His eyes was on the ball, I think he won a bit of the ball, but I haven't seen it back, so I need to look back at it before I uh, make a judge on it. Yeah. And with the red card, of course, going down to 10 men, the pockets of space opened up for them in the midfield, and it just kind of created chances for them, didn't they, to slot the through balls in? Well, definitely, when you're coming against a team like Everton, um, it's hard enough playing with 11 men. Uh, we was getting into a good rhythm in the second half, the, the red card changed game. Um, very harsh red card, like I've said, and... Um, like we've just got to move on now. Obviously, they, they they cut us open several times towards the end of the game, and especially in the last two goals, we shouldn't be conceding them. We should be taking the game at two 0 and moving on. But um, it's our fault. We've got we've got ourselves to blame for that. Is it just one of those afternoons where you have to look and think maybe if we take one of those chances, get the equaliser, it would have been a whole different game? Well, I think yeah. Like I said, um, I think late on in the sixty minutes, Robbo has a good chance at the far post. It's a side netting and. You never know if that goes in, then we're probably the side that's got the momentum looking for the win. Um, we knew we knew at half-time, even though we didn't perform to our best in the first half, we, we was right in the game, they didn't cut us open, they didn't, they didn't create many chances to say that we wasn't at our best. And We knew if we upped our game a tiny bit, then we were right in the game, and that's what we did the second half. But, like I've said, uh, decisions change games, and a big decision has changed the game today.